how you doing? This is Andy Brown with Boomers Offshore. We're uh, we're doing another day trip. This time we're in the Central Valley. We're uh, a little bit north of San Ramon in the town of La Balsa. Uh, we're heading up towards Lake Arenal and La Fortuna. We're in an area right now that's known as the Los Angeles Cloud Forest. And as you can see outside the window, all we really have right now is clouds and fog. About six to seven kilometers south of us will be the town of San Ramon, and I guarantee you at this point in time, it is absolutely sunny and without, uh, without any kind of fog. But it's when you raise into the altitude, and we're about 3,100, 3,200 feet right now, uh, you start getting much more fog and wind and rain. And this is what's indigenous to this part of the country. So we're just kind of cruising through here. We're heading out towards Lake Arenal right now, where hopefully it's going to be a little bit sunnier and maybe a little bit warmer. Right now we're freezing our butts off and trying to make our way through the clouds. So uh, hang on. We'll be back shortly. Yes. Now we brought our pedos with us. No pedas. There's Upe and there's Ashka. And they came for our little road trip adventure. And they're just chilling in the back seat, kind of checking things out. And there's Upe's big, big face in the camera. Ashka's just chilling off to the side. Many of the roads that connect between small towns throughout Costa Rica are only two-lane roads. And you're stuck between large trucks. What you have to do is seize the opportunity and go around these guys like that to where you can start getting back to a normal speed again. This way, otherwise you're stuck doing about five, six kilometers an hour, and that's no way to make the distance between small towns. Now this is more like it. Uh, we're only about maybe five, six kilometers uh, out of the clouds. The uh, sun is shining through, the fog is now lifted, and we are in absolutely beautiful weather. Again, this goes to uh, what they refer to here in Costa Rica as microclimates, where you don't have to go very far, and all of a sudden, uh, five or six kilometers away, it is absolutely gorgeous. One thing that's really important to notice here is, look at how green and lush everything is here. 365 days a year, everything is beautiful, green, and in this part of the uh, country, relatively sunny. We're coming up into the central town of La Tigra as we approach uh, La Fortuna and then Lago Arenal. We're now in the touristy town of Fortuna. Fortuna is the uh, on the front end uh, or on the southern end of Lake Arenal. Lots of hotels, lots of restaurants, and as you can see, it even has its own Burger King. Give me a break. Volcano Arenal is not going to be seen today. It's completely, it's completely encrusted in clouds, uh, so there's no way we're going to be able to see anything coming out of the top, any vapor vents, or anything. It's all clouded in. Well, here it is. This is our first view of Lake Arenal as we come out of the Fortuna area and now crossing over the bridge, approaching Lake Arenal. So here we are, we've been driving now for a couple of hours out of the San Ramon area, and we've seen various climates as we've gone along the way. Some very foggy, to beautiful sunny, to a little overcast, and now we're near the uh, Lake Arnal area. Um, and now it's, it, you know, it's a little chilly, but not bad. I'm sure it would be wonderful sleeping weather. And here we've got uh, Arnal just right over my shoulder, and it's so beautiful and lush and green. 
So you can find anything you like in this country. Well, you can't go skiing. But other than that, well, water skiing, but not snow skiing. Um, you can find any climate that you love. So here we are in the, uh, I guess it's Nuevo Almernal area and uh, heading towards home to Playa Hermosa where we're going to see it, I'm hopefully we're going to see it very sunny, beautiful, hot, 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 and uh, very brown. Now we're really lush and in a, probably about another 30 minutes or so we'll stop into town see if we can get something to eat because I'm starting to get really hungry. So enjoy the beautiful sight over my right shoulder. Highway 142, which circles Lake Arenal, is a fully paved road, all except for these 25 to 30 meters that we have in front of us. This is the, I don't know why, but it's been like three or four years now, maybe three years since we last traveled this road. And this is the only section of the highway that goes around Lake Arenal that is unpaved. Sorry if I'm getting you guys sick right now, but this is the only section of Arnal, the lake highway that is not paved. And it's been this way for over three bloody years. So, have no answer for that? Again, don't ask why. Costa Rica derives a large portion of its electronic power from geothermal as well as wind. And back of me is a wind farm at the northern end of Lake Arenal. They make so much electricity because of the wind, of the wind farm right here, that they sell the surplus back to Nicaragua and Panama. That answer me one question, why in the hell are we paying so much electricity if we're selling surplus back to Nicaragua? Sí, sí, sí. Si gusta pase adelante. Ahí tenemos artesanía. Le damos una explicación sobre el sector de nosotros, leyendas, cuentos. En fin, puedes aprender algo de nosotros. Yo uh, vivo en uh, Playa Hermosa, Guanacaste. Playa Hermosa. Sí, sí. So uh, ustedes, uh, nosotros, no, ya, yeah, nosotros uh, visitamos uh, en este área. Ya. Yeah. Sí. Uh, por uh, solo un día. Solo por un día. Sí. Sí. Yeah. sí. No, si gustan pasen adelante para que vean las cosas que tenemos y conozcan algo de la cultura de nosotros los malecos. Okay. Sí. Sí. Otra vez, otra vez a uh, ustedes a uh, visitar a uh, usted uh, aquí. Okay. 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 Perfecto. Bueno. Okay. Bueno. Hasta luego. Hasta luego. We finally left the Lake Adenau area and we're heading west. The uh, we're now in the town of Tileran and heading off towards the Keep town of... Keep on 142. Excuse me. And heading off to the town of Cañas. Cañas is the, is the last town we hit before we hit the Pan American Highway. Continue 21 kilometers on 142. Very good, and I will do that. Before we hit the town of Liberia, and then we're uh, home free from there. So you've just seen it, you've seen the town of Tilleran. Next up is the town of Cañas. The farther we get away from Lake Arenal, the drier the area gets, the less green things appear. It's uh, warming up quite a bit. The uh, temperature has gone up probably about 10 to 12 degrees, and now it's uh, had to shed the jacket. Humidity is going down, and uh, again, Pura Vida. It's beautiful out here today. Well, we finally hit the town of Cañas. Cañas is really going to be the last significantly large city that we hit before we turn on to the Pan American Highway and head north to the town of Liberia. Now we're going to be heading right 
on to Autopista. This is the uh, this is Route One. Well, we have just about completed our trip. We're now uh, completely out of the rainforest. We are deep into Guanacaste, into uh, as we approach Liberia. Not only are we tired, we're a little sore, but we're also a little bit hungry. And after four hours, five hours of being on the road, there's really only one thing that's going to solve and satisfy our hunger right now. And that is we've got to go gringo. <laughs> and what better way to go gringo than by... Hola. I uh, need a uh, un cuarto de libra um, uh, combo, por favor. Please. Cuarto de libra con queso o a la pica? Uh, con queso. Y tres uh, hamburguesas uh, con queso. Ok, el combo es con papas fritas. Sí. Coca-Cola. Sí. Grande. Uh, no, medio, por favor. ¿Algo más? Uh, no, solamente. 4,870, siguiente ventana. Muchas gracias. Con mucho gusto. Well, there we go. Let's see now if I got what I ordered. Hola. 4,870. Gracias. Con mucho gusto. Otra ventana. Ok. Gracias. Buen día. Ok. We did it. We got our food. And now we're off. Okay, this has been a very, very fun, very, very fun day. We're on the last leg of our journey right now, back to, uh, back home. And let me cut off a car here. There we go, we're on the road. And all I wanna say right now is, it's been fun making the video. And this is Andy Brown and Fran Brown behind the camera from Boomers Offshore saying, rock and roll, we're out of here, and now it's time to eat a hamburger while we go home. Adios. Not bad. For Costa Rica. Ticket. All right, all right, all right, all right. Okay. We have two of them, but I'll let you split it right now. We even take care of our girls. They didn't have. They had a light breakfast this morning, so we're gonna give them a hand. Right. Look how nice Upe's waiting. Ash, Ashka will inhale this in about two seconds. Okay. Oh, see, look how gentle. What's this?